<laughs> what is up guys uh, bringing you a little team deathmatch on the map resistance you know as you could tell obviously I didn't have to tell you that it's been a while since I brought some Modern Warfare 3 to my channel and I wanted to uh, wanted to give you guys something interesting to look at while well, I told you this awesome story uh, <laughs> I'm sorry I've been super busy uh, with school and just writing papers that I haven't really got around to doing anything really I tried to play some Modern Warfare 3 the other day realized that my mic was broken <sighs> it's devastating 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 but that's not what I want to talk about. I want to talk about my battle with Machinima I had recently. It wasn't really a, a battle, it was just kind of pointing out that they, uh, they false flag DMCA or, uh, they flaw, you know, the, the copyright issues. They, they false flag them and they take down videos that they have, uh, no rights to. And what I mean by this is recently I posted a video on my second channel, uh, talking about the Reply Girls and, um, it was a video of me in front of my green wall. Like, okay. Just me, just me vlogging in front of my green wall. Nothing, uh, you know, I own the rights to all that because it's me in front of my wall. And uh, I received an email, you know, I mean, the Cash shared it. The video got a ton of response. I mean, it got like, I think it's right now at like 22,000 views or something like that. So it was very popular. You know, the person that I was talking about, you know, caught wind and she had all her little, well, two trolls come over and try to, uh, try to bash it and tell me that the video was going to be taken down. Well, I guess she reported it to Machinima that, uh, because she's a Machinima partner, go figure, they partnered some, uh, some uh, shitty ass no, reply girl, girl and uh -huh. <laughs> I guess she flagged it as copyright so I don't That's Machinima gross. sent me an email after I you know uh, <coughs> sent them an email saying what the fuck this is me in front of a green wall I don't understand how I copyright anything in here it's my own you know body my sexy ass body and they they referred to uh, they referred me to my thumbnail being a copy uh, like a copywritten image, which was it was a uh, pretty much a thumbnail from one of her videos that she had posted, and I took it and I kind of altered it a little bit, and I posted it as my thumbnail. Now, uh, that thumbnail is covered under fair use, regardless if Machinima wants to believe it or not. Um, there was a court case in 2003 which dealt with thumbnails specifically, because a company uh, took down a video. And uh, I think it was a video. Either the company sued the guy or the guy sued the company because uh, I think the company sued the guy. And uh, what had happened was the company that sued him had to uh, uh, violate copyright without fair use def without a fair use defense because uh, the thumbnails, if you use a thumbnail, like if I were to use, uh, like, I don't know, like, I'm trying to think. Like if I were to use, like, uh, the Hop Hog PVR in my thumbnail. Now, that picture, that item itself is, you know, copywritten. Like, if I were just to throw up a picture of the Hop Hog PVR and was just like, uh, that could be, uh, you know, a copyright image or whatever. But you you can use it to context. So if I were to put the thumbnail up of her and I talked about her in my video, the thumbnail then becomes fair use. One, because they claim that, you know, the, once it's been posted, it loses aesthetic value and all this other nonsense. But needless to say, the court has, you know, ruled that using thumbnails is under you know is protected by fair use that's why you see people use thumbnails all the time that have you know some kind of copywritten image like you can go and you see you know Kanye West in some thumbnails but you know if Machinima was gonna take down my video due to that say say my thumbnail was copywritten okay uh, the partner from them who reported my video has many thumbnails with copywritten images in them so it seems to me that the, the standards were skewed uh, just because, you know, she's a machinima partner and they just wanted to feel like they could censor the internet because it was, uh, you know, a kind of kind of bashing video towards her. So needless to say, be careful what you post. Uh, any machinima partner gets a little uh, antsy in the pantsy. They can just go ahead and get your video taken down. So make sure your thumbnails, uh, you know, reply, you know, and, you know, obviously comply to uh, machinima standards because they are obviously different than the internet's standards but needless to say the video's back up i'll go ahead and i'll link you to that video if you want to watch it it's kind of interesting uh, thank you guys for watching hope you enjoyed the rant what are your feelings on this do you believe that the video uh was protected under fair use or uh or what let me know